Hi, I'm Drew Moyer, and this is an equation for solving for the coordinates of a triangle. To solve for the coordinates, we're going to need the equations of each of the three lines that make up the triangle. So suppose I have AB is equal to y equals 2x plus 1, BC will be y equals negative x minus 2, and CA will be y equals 1 half x minus 2. And to find the points of this triangle, we're going to need to set up three separate systems of equations which are used to find the intersection point where two lines will meet. And I'm going to need to do that three separate times. So point A, I know, must meet at the intersection of AB and CA. So my system of equations is going to look like this. y equals 2x plus 1. And under that, I'm going to write y equals 1 half x minus 2. Now there's a couple different ways that you can solve for a system of equations. I'm going to use the substitution method, which you get by knowing that both y values equal two different things, therefore those two different things must equal each other. So I will set up my equation just like this, 2x plus 1 equals 1 half x minus 2. And now I'm simply going to solve for x. First I'm going to multiply everything by 2 to get rid of this fraction. 4x plus 2 equals x minus 4. And then I will bring this x over to this side by subtracting it. Oh, positive 3x plus 2 equals minus 4. And then I will bring this 2 over here by also subtracting it. So I'll get 3x equals negative 6. Then divide both sides by 3. x equals negative 2. And there I have the x-coordinate of the intersection point of these two lines, the x-coordinate of point A. And to get the y-coordinate, it's very easy. All I have to do is plug this value in to either one of the two equations that I already used. I'm going to use this one because it's easier. So I would have y equals 2 times negative 2 plus 1, y equals negative 4 plus 1, which is negative 3. So I know that point A is at negative 2, negative 3. So I'll graph that, negative 2, negative 3, right there. So now I've got point A. And point B and C are going to be solved the exact same way. So point B, I know, is at the point where AB meets BC. So I can set up y equals 2x plus 1 and y equals negative x minus 2. Set them equal to each other. 2x plus 1 equals negative x minus 2. I'm going to add x to both sides. 3x plus 1 equals negative 2. Subtract 1 from both sides. 3x equals negative 3. Divide both sides by 3 and I get x equals negative 1. And then same thing, I take that value and plug it back into the easier equation. y equals 2 times negative 1 plus 1, which equals negative 2 plus 1, which is negative 1. So I know that this point, b, resides at negative 1, negative 1. Negative 1, negative 1 right here. And again, one more for good measure, I'm going to find point C by finding the intersection of BC and CA. BC is y equals negative x minus 2, and CA is y equals 1 half x minus 2. I'll set them equal to each other. Negative x minus 2 equals 1 half x minus 2. And here I see that I have minus 2's on both sides. So if I add 2 to both sides, they will drop out. So now I have negative x equals 1 half x, which doesn't make any sense, so I know that x must equal 0. And I plug that value back in to the easier equation. y equals negative 0 minus 2, which equals negative 2. So I know my point C resides at 0, negative 2. 0, negative 2, right here. And then, just a game of connect the dots, and I have my triangle. So again, I'm Drew Moyer, 
and this is an equation for solving for the coordinates of a triangle. Thank you.